how to hard reset the Google Nexus 4. Now there are two ways that you can hard reset. If your phone is not stuck and you can access the menu system, you can simply go into the menu here. So tap on the app icon. Then from here, go into settings. In settings, you want to scroll down to under the personal section. Tap on backup and reset. Now there are a few options down here. Simply go straight down to the bottom where you say factory data reset. Tap on that. From here, it will warn you that it will erase um, your Google account, your system data, apps, music photos, and other user data. Now make sure that you really want to do this because um, once you uh, go ahead, all your data will be lost. So if there is anything that you want to back up, now is the time to do so before you reset your phone. Now if you are certain that you want to go ahead, simply tap on the reset phone. <coughs> then choose erase everything. So now the phone is starting to uh, wipe itself out and uh, we starting again. At this point, all your data is gone, so there's no chance of you getting it back unless you have restored it previously. So now you can see it's uh, erasing. You have an Android icon here. Now, in the next uh, methods, I'm going to show you how to reset with a hardware key. Now if your phone is stuck and you can't do anything, um, you can basically need to use the hardware key to reset the phone. Now if you can't turn off the phone, simply just um, press and hold to the power button here for around 5 to 10 seconds so that you could get the phone restarted and you will have the opportunity to shut it down. So I'm going to, um, once the phone is uh, successfully started, I will try to uh, use the power button to reset the phone. Okay, if your phone is stuck and you cannot do anything, you can use the hardware key to uh, perform a hard reset. Now first you need to shut down the phone, so press and hold to the power button on the side here. And then choose power off, then tap on OK. And wait for your phone to uh, shut down. Once it has turned off, press on the power button and the volume down key over here, both at the same time. to get up the recovery menu. So let's go, when you see the menu appears, now you can see it says start. Now you can use the volume down or volume up key to navigate to the next menu item. So press on the volume down key, then press on it again to get to the recovery mode. Then press on the power key over here to make the selection. Next, you should see an Android icon with an exclamation mark on top. Now the next step is a bit tricky. You need to press and hold to the power button and then press and release on the volume key up and let go. Once you see the blue menu appear, let all of your finger go. So I'm going to do it now. Press on to the power key and then press and release the, the, all your finger. So once the menu appears, I'm going to put my phone right in so you can see the menu item here. So there are several options. The first option is say reboot system now. The next is apply update from ADB. Next is wipe data or factory resets. And the last option is wipe cache partition. So you can use the menu uh, down key to go to the next option. So you want to go down to uh, wipe data or factory resets. So once you get to that option, simply press on the power key here to make the selection. And again, on the next menu, you should see it say no, 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 up to seven times and down to the yes. The reason they're doing this is because they don't want you to accidentally uh, delete the data. So just go down using the volume key over here, down key to uh, go down to the next menu item. So keep pressing it until you get to the yes. Once you get to the yes, delete all user data. Use the power button over here to make the selection. Next, you should see it say wiping data formatting the device 
So your phone is now um, um, resetting itself. So just wait for the phone to finish. So when it has completed the task, simply um, uh, make the selection where it say reboot system now, which is the first option, and then press on the power key here to make the selection. So the phone has restarted. So that's how you can reset the Google Nexus 4 using uh, two different methods. One is through the menu system and one is to use through the hardware key. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you enjoy it. Please subscribe to my channel for more video tutorials.